Good evening, YouTubers. It's Justin or New Time Travel Jaime 88 or Real New Time Travel Jaime 88, should I say. And welcome back to my YouTube channel. And tonight, I am going to show off this Ghostbusters 3 movie collection. All right. As you can see, I have three, count them, three Ghostbusters movies on DVD, Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters 2, and Ghostbusters Afterlife. And I'm a huge fan of Ghostbusters because Ghostbusters is probably one of my favorite, next to my favorite movies of the 1980s. And I really love it. Now, I don't have the, the three movie connection on one box set. Let me show you what it looks like. There we go. All right. Now, if you're a diehard Ghostbusters fan, this set is amazing to pick up. Yep. Before we dive into these sets, I'd like to give a quick shout out to, let me find his channel name, Media Fan 2001. Media Fan 2001, your videos are excellent. Keep up the good work. Make sure you check out his channel. I'll leave a link in the description and let's get down to business. Let me get these two to the side. We'll start off with Ghostbusters. Who are you going to call? Ghostbusters. Yes, Ghostbusters, the 1984 movie with Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Sigourney Weaver, Harold Ramis, and Rick Moranis. Rest in peace to Harold Ramis and Ivan Reitman, who contributed this film, and Ivan Reitman directed this film. Reitman passed away this year on Valentine's Day. Here's the back. Here's the... Zoom in. Here's the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. And here's Peter, Ray, Egon, and Winston. If you can focus here, focus. There we go. There, that's more like it, sort of. But that's, that'll do. Don't forget, you got a special features with commentary by Ivan Reitman, Joe Manchuk, and Harold Ramis, actor and writer. Now, only feature is gone is the video style commentary like Mystery Science Theater 3000 style. That's removed. The only way you can find it is on a 1999 release. Then you got the deleted scenes. Now, at the time when Ghostbusters premiered on DVD for the first time, they had most of the deleted scene. But fast forward to 2019, they included more, more scenes in there. That's good. And then you got the making of featurette, two featurettes, one's from 1984 and the other one's from 1999. There's a storyboard and that's it. The only gone is the visual effects comparison. That's on the special feature. That's gone on there. Not included is the original theatrical trailer. The only way you can find it is on the, the 1999 DVD release and the, the current DVD and Blu-ray and 4K released. Let's see. The running time is, is 105 minutes, rated PG. And in 2.40 by 1 widescreen edition. You can camera can focus here. Focused. There we go. Uh, that's more like it. Let's take a look. The DVD has got the No Ghost logo. Now, one of my favorite parts in Ghostbusters when Peter Vakeman acts the scientist and, you know, with this little mime thingy, and he buzz him and oh, it gave me a total shock. I studied the negative effect. The effect I told you, the effect is 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 ripping me off. Yes, <laughs> you keep the five five dollar, Mister. Well, maybe I will. 
<laughs> yeah. And one of my favorite scene when they went into the um the library say, and they hear Egon say, B -B -E boom, <laughs> yes. And they would chase out of the library by the scary ghost. And also, my favorite line of Ghostbusters when they drive down there is when Ray Potts pulls in the Cadillac hearse, the millimeter 59. And Peter said, you can't park it there. Everybody relax. I found a Celsa car. How much? Only 4800 And these wires and shocks and new muffler little wiring. Yeah. And, and there's a favorite line in the movie. I have memorized the lines. Some of it. Like, if you show me where the contaminant unit, I will come back to do a court order. You go get the court order. And I'll sue your funny face for wrongful prosecution. You can have you want, Mr. Bakeman. Yes, I love that one. That's my favorite part. And also, they had the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. And then Ray told him, Gozer the Gazarian. And after that, the Gozer saying, Are you God? No. Whoops. Well, and next time, and Winston said, when someone asks you if you're God, you say, yes. Well, you'll find out in the third go around. Yes. <laughs> and also, and one of my favorite part of Ghostbusters is when they had the Ghostbusters montage and you had Casey Kasem on there. Yeah. And also my favorite line of Egon when he's doing the samples of the Twinkie. Yeah. That's my favorite part of it. And it says here, my favorite line, it says, let's say this Twinkie represents the normal amount of of psychokinetic energy in the New York area. According to this morning sample, it would be a Twinkie 35 feet long and weighing approximately 600 pounds. <coughs> That's a big Twinkie. Hey, tell him about the Twinkie. And Peter said, what about the Twinkie? <laughs> yes, and he also, in the, in the hotel, he said, come in, Ray. Fake man, I saw, I saw. He's right here, Ray. It's a little spud, isn't it? It's a slimer. He's slimy. And then this Stay Puff Marshmallow Man came up there and said, Ray is going, Peter told Egon, Ray is going bye-bye, Egon. Hi, when you got, do you have anything left? Sorry, Vakeman. I terrified by the bionic capacity for rational thoughts. And, and all this, at the end of Stay Puff Marshmallow, blows up and all this covering marshmallow. That's not really marshmallow. Uh-uh. That is a pound of shaving cream down there. Yeah. Those, I've seen this movie 105 times. It is great. And here's Ghostbusters 2, 1989. With, once again, Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Sigourney Weaver, Harold Ramis, Rick Moranis, Ernie Hudson, Annie Potts. And then you also have new characters, including Peter McNichol as Janos. Then you got the judge, played by Harold Eulen. And, um... Yes, and there's the prosecutor. Can't remember, the lady uh, prosecutor. I can't remember who's the lady name, but if someone else let me know. It's been a long time since I watched Ghostbusters 2. And um, one of my favorite part of Ghostbusters too, and when they when they when they when they, when they play Jackie Wilson's higher and higher, and they toast her dance to it. <laughs> I said, no, 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 this is probably a warning here. It's like, oh, ow, ow, ow. I said, the old finger, the old man eating toaster. Get him! <laughs> yes, and also um, one of my favorite part in the, the courtroom scene. It says. Um, at it's Scalari Brothers, friends of yours. I'm trying to give him up for a ch chair, 
Grown just too something. Why don't you tell him to believe no ghosts? And then one of my favorite part when Louis that thing that's me my client out there that blue thing out there trying to expose everyone and you don't want us exposing ourselves <laughs> and yeah and also the montage with Ghostbusters with Run DNC that's amazing and and then you got the and the one scene it deleted. When Ray, the possessed Ray, driving mad D on the Ghostbusters at the 1A and probably crash into an oncoming truck or a garbage truck. That is. Um, a hope, I, I know it's not included on the, the Ultimate Collection. I hope one day we will see the light to get a proper uh, deleted scene because you know... Um, Ah, uh, boy, it's been a long, they filmed the, the, the filming of the possessed sequence on there, and they used stunt car on there, so, and I know at the beginning of Ghostbusters, the Ecto-1, it broke down, now during the production of Ghostbusters, the original Ecto-1, it broke down, and I got, I believe it's stuck on the bridge, yeah, I think it got broke down. So, um, that's what a deleted scene of Ghostbusters. It's not on the on the the ultimate collection, but I hope it will be. Um, and that's why they, I love the Ecto 1A, because they got more gadgets on there. And also the Ecto 1A. I mean the Ecto 1. Now, fun fact, the Ecto 1 was originally supposed to be black. So instead it went it a uh, White set of black with the Cadillac 59 Cadillac millimeter Hearst ambulance. Mm hmm. And there's Oscar and played by these two twin uh, actors. One actor uh, had passed away. And there's um, another actor played Vigo. And I know, I know it was dubbed by Max von Sydow. He was uncredited. I am Vigo, the Scarsh of Carpathia. Command you. Command me, Lord. Yes. And here's the still pictures. And here's Winston about to fight Ray. It was that stuff, pure concentrated evil. Now, you only get these two episodes from Ghostbusters. They are Citizen Ghosts and Partners in Slime. And this one is 108 minutes, but it actually is 102 minutes on there. And this is widescreen, 2.35 by 1. While this Ghostbusters is 240, 2.40 by 1. Let's take a look. And here you got these, the DVD of the sketch. Nothing much, but... I'm glad it got the, the deleted scene for Ghostbusters 2 when it came out on Blu-ray and for the 30th, 35th anniversary. Yes. Hopefully the 40th anniversary down the line in 2024. Hopefully you'll have some more good goodies out there. And finally, Ghostbusters Afterlife. And this one stars... This... Carrie Coons, Finn Wolfhart, McKenna Grace, um, Annie Potts, Ernie Hudson, Paul Rudd, and also has the cameos by appearances by Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, also Ernie Hudson, Sigourney Weaver, Annie Potts, and then you got Celeste O'Connor. Yep, that's and. I didn't know, she, and she's from Baltimore. Yep, she's from Baltimore. Cool. And then you got uh, Logan, Logan Kim, Kim's podcast. And there's the Ecto-1, the rusted one. Now, the big question is, I wonder what happened, what it did to this logo right here when they went back to this one. All right, you got some special features, including the making of Ghostbusters Afterlife, and there's the rusty Ecto-1. It should have been the Ecto-1A. Uh, I know this car is the reuse of the Ecto-1A, but it hasn't been confirmed yet. I know Sony destroyed the, uh, reportedly destroyed the Ecto-1 car. And here's the DVD. 
Here's the free movies, and there's the ultraviolet code in the back, which I'm not going to show the code. All right. And if you have not seen this movie, check them out. I'm not going to give you guys the details because I don't want to spoil the outcomes of Afterlife. Okay. There you go. And that's it for this week's video. Make sure you guys hit rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.